Hello everybody, Swaminath here. Today I'm going to show you drop shipment process. That is how Amazon sells its product to the customer. So it gets the material from the vendor and sells it to the customer. That is what drop shipment is all about. Gets the IMAX Pro from the vendor and sells it to the customer. This is what the business processes are, processes. Vendor is the seller who sells the product to the customer and vendor pays the Amazon pays it to the vendor and customer pays it to the Amazon. This is the drop shipment process. Let me show that in the SAP system. Let's go to the SAP system. Now I want to create the sales order. Go to VA01. Go to create a sales order. OR. Transaction code OR. Thousand sales organization. Distribution channel 10. Division 0. Now we enter the sold to party. This way sold to party. Enter payment terms, input terms. This is my material. One quantity has been ordered. See, purchase requisition is being created once when we enter the plant. Double click onto this line item. Go to shipping. Enter the plant. Thousand is my plant. See a purchase requisition on the background of it. Purchase requisition gets created. This is the dummy price. I'm entering the dummy price. Once I create the purchase order, that is the actual price has been entered. Storage location. Enter the net weight and gross weight. One case and gross weight and gross weight. Let me enter the gross weight. Back and save it. Let me save this. This way, sales order number. So now let's go to slash in PA03 to check the purchase requisition. On the background of it, purchase requisition will be created during the creation of the sales order. Double click onto this line item, go to the schedule lines. This is my purchase requisition. See, purchase requisition is being created. Based on the purchase requisition, I'm going to create the purchase order. This is my PR. PR. Based on this, I'm going to order confirmation with the vendor. Slash in ME21A. Now I'm going to confirm the order with the vendor. Wherein vendor is going to send, her, send the material to the customer directly. From its plant to the customer. See here, this is my purchase requisition. Adapt. See, this is my vendor. This is my vendor. Okay. Now, this guy is going to send it directly to the customer. Save it. Save. This is my purchase order. Let me take this purchase order. Now, let me do invoice verification. Considering that vendor has been Supplied its material, supplied the iPhone to the customer. Now I'm going to do vendor invoice. I'm going to do vendor payment. Select tax codes. Calculate tax. Enter purchase order number here. Scroll up. Okay. This is the amount. One lakh. 30,900. Enter the baseline date before which we have to pay to the vendor and save it. So now, vendor has supplied to the customer and I'm going to build the custom. BF0. Build the customer. Let's enter based on the sales order. See, this is the net, net term. Net value and save it. This is what is all about drop shipment, wherein we give the order to the vendor. Vendor will be sending it to the customer from its plant to the customer. Now, vendor bills the bills us and we bill the customer. 
That is what the business process is all about. Thank you.